fam, it's your girl Gladys, aka That Your Hair, and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, welcome. Tap that subscribe button so that you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. And if you've been rocking with me for a minute, what's up, what's good, and welcome back. Today is 20 Hour Tuesdays. 20 Hour Tuesdays is a special time on my channel where I showcase super cute, yet super affordable wigs for the lovely price of $20 and below. So let's just jump right in. Today we have a lovely unit by Outre. It is a half wig and the name of this wig is Chindo. C-H-I-N-D-O, Chindo, yeah. I have Chindo in the color 2T30. This is a half wig, but I am wearing it as a full wig because I have it pulled all the way forward. It does come with the two combs in the front and a comb in the back with an adjustable strap. And with the newer half wigs by Outre, the front is different, so that way it will lay flatter in case you do want to wear your hair out and maybe pull it back. Let me give you a quick 360. We'll jump right into my thoughts. Let me tell y'all right now, I'm definitely feeling chindo, and I'm gonna tell you why, starting with the pros. First pro out the pack is this color. Normally, I'm a little wary about 2T30 on me because I feel like it blends in with my skin with straighter units. For example, I reviewed Outre Shanice in a 2T30 some time ago, and the color had a grow on me. Like, I felt like it looked good on camera, but in person, I wasn't too sure. But this color and this kinky curly wig is definitely working for me. I feel like it's highlighting my undertone so nicely, and wearing it with this yellow shirt is just perfect. So yes, yes, yes to the 2T30. I almost got the natural color, but I was like, you know what, Gladys? Let's just do a little bit of color in this kinky curly wig before summer is over. So I hope y'all are feeling it. Let me know in the comments if you are feeling this color too. Next pro to this unit is the curl pattern. It is definitely mimicking 4B4C natural hair after a twist out. My hair doesn't look like this naturally, like wash day. My hair is very kinky curly, twisty twirly all over the place. But if I do decide to twist it up and let it dry overnight and separate the twist afterwards, it would come out looking just like this. But who wants to color their natural hair all the time? I sure don't. I don't miss those days at all. I like protecting my natural hair as much as possible. Color is just like an iffy thing. You can have healthy hair with color, of course, but for me, I just have to be super, super careful because my hair is very delicate. So I love being able to find affordable wigs that have color so I can experiment and it's a natural look. Oh my God, I think this is so freaking pretty. I wish I bought this wig earlier in the summer. Now another month we're gonna be transitioning into fall, but that's fine because this is such a beautiful rustic color for the fall as well. I just can't stop looking Looking at myself in her, she is cute. What? Y'all, let me tell you right now, I don't have any cons to this wig. I don't have any cons. The cap size is fine, definitely big head friendly. It's stretchy. Y'all know I like the curl pattern. If you know me, you know I love textures like this. She's beautiful. And of course the biggest pro is the price. This retails for as low as $16, y'all. $16. Hello. Who's on the website? Are you? Are you on the website? Did you click the link? Because this is a steal, okay? Now, some of you might be wondering how this compares to other kinky curly wigs I've tried. For example, if you watch my top 10 synthetic wigs of all time, you know that one of my top 10 is Bella Bella Bounce Bob. If you haven't checked out that video, I highly suggest that you check it out after this video because there are a lot of great favorites on there. But yes, Bounce Bob, how does it compare to this wig? Well, Bounce Bob is definitely longer and I have her in a natural color. Bounce Bob is not available in a 2T30. It's only available in like a, like a 99J or something like that. That, but it's like a 99J at the tips. So I would say this wig has a few more available colors versus Bounce Bob. I love Bounce Bob definitely due to the length, but this is very similar. Like this could be her cousin, her sister even. This also reminds me of another natural wig, Vela Vela Pepe. I haven't reviewed that wig on my channel, but I love that wig. And this reminds me of Pepe so much. Actually, these might be almost identical. Like now that I'm looking at it more, almost identical. But Pepe also does not come in this color. So if you want this type of blonde variety, I would definitely pick up Chindu because this is so gorgeous. And if you prefer your natural number two 1B color, you already know. People are gonna be looking like, is that your hair? Come on, this is gorgeous. 
absolutely gorgeous. I'm definitely feeling her. So let me know how you feel about Chindo in the comments down below. Would you purchase her? I think she's a great unit, especially for the season that we're in right now. Yes, we're in summer, but she's also a great transitional unit into the fall. She's very pretty, beautiful color, nice and lightweight too. She doesn't feel heavy on my head at all. She may look like a lot of hair, but y'all, she's not a lot of hair. I did do a quite a bit of cutting and shaping to her. And this is the amount of hair that I ended up taking out, which is not a lot in the grand scheme of things. Please don't be intimidated about cutting your wigs, y'all. Cutting your wigs is how you can take a wig that's a five to a 10. Seriously, out the pack this wig is gorgeous, but I just knew I would have to wear her like this because I don't have like a headband to kind of cover up where the half wig starts or anything and I'm not leaving my hair out. So this style works best for me and I think she is so freaking cute. Let me know down below if you feel the same or not. If you wanna see other textured units, check out my textured wig playlist. Also, make sure you check out my top 10 textured wigs. That video is so lit. I received a lot of love from you all on that video. Check it out, I will link it down below. And if you're new here, make sure you tap the subscribe button, hit the notification bell so that you don't miss anything coming up and if you want to see some of my latest videos check them out over here to the right of me you may as well just go click over there and check out the lookbook that i put out yesterday or click over here and check out my top 10 texture wigs either one is your choice thank you so much for joining me for my dollar tuesday and i will see